Hi, I'm Brad, and I suck at games. So of course, I beat really hard games. And I don't get any of this money until I beat them. Catch me live every day on Twitch at twitch.tv slash braddoeslife. Oh my god, dude. Holy shit. We all know after you beat Hello Kitty, Kitty will only take like 30 minutes to beat the rest of the game. Exactly. I'll have unlocked all the skills required to beat the rest of the game. I'm gonna be honest, it doesn't feel great that I like barely make contact when I shoot my bullets. Dude, I'm totally at the mercy of the... I just don't get it. I'm totally at the mercy of where the freaking things spawn. I don't know how... I don't know the tech. I've gotta fucking VOD review it, man. There's got to be an obvious pattern. Because all the other things are not that hard. Like, I die a lot on phase one, but I feel like it's just because I'm not paying enough attention. What can you do? It's a platformer, not a puzzle game. True, but I do feel like there is possibility that there's a routing that you need to take. Let's see, let's see. Let's look, let's look back at my most recent clip here. Sorry that you guys won't be able to see this. I'll get Christian to help me uh, deal with this at some point. Okay, all I care about is I'm looking at where everything spawns. I have no idea. What can you do? I actually have no idea. I just looked at it. There's no obvious gaps. Yeah, I think you've just got to practice. Oh my God, I almost left my freaking mouse in there. I think you just have to find the gaps in real time and be able to make sure that you navigate to them. Because it's not deterministic. I was hoping they were deterministic. Doesn't seem that way. But you know what? It's fine. Okay, we just gotta look for the gaps. We just gotta look for the gaps. What can you do? Some games have bullet patterns based on your movement, but here it's literally completely random. Well, it's like, I think the problem is it throws them in a fixed way, but you don't know where it's gonna start. So like, it just goes like, wee, you know, because it just spawns them as it's moving at like a fixed part of its body. And it's not like they go in like a, like a random direction. 
or anything. They go and I think they just go straight forward. Like you just get boxed in. There's nothing you can do. Oh my God. It feels based on where you are when it starts, but I don't think Hello Kitty no, because it just spawns on Hello Kitty, I'm pretty sure. So this run, watch Hello Kitty. As that attack starts going, I think it spawns on Hello Kitty. And the problem is that Hello Kitty... So like, these are based on where you're standing, obviously. And Hello Kitty doesn't even have to be near it. Now the tiny Hello Kitty is raining down. Again, nothing to do with where you're standing. And now start to watch Hello Kitty. Oh, wait. What? I always thought it looked like it was coming off of her, but I just watched where it spawns from. It spawns from the center of the screen. So then you must be right. I thought it was spawning off her. No, I had to itch my fucking nose. They do just go forward, but it starts spawning at the center of the screen. That's interesting. This is actually useful te tech. Best run yet. I think that was easily the best run yet. So I actually think that pointing that out. <laughs> Rip off the nose never again. This is what it feels like when uh, you accidentally lose focus and you were like in flow, you know, like I think that that could have been the run just solely based off of the fact that I made it through the first one. I feel like I had inertia. Like, what can you do? I was just in a really bad spot because I let the Hello Kitties box me off from the platforms. Does anyone else think this sounds like a fucking Minecraft mob? What's that thing called? What's the thing called the Minecraft mob? Ghasts. Is it using the ghast sound effect? Or am I making that up? Yeah, it sounds a lot like uh, what it sounds like in the ether. Ether? Nether. It's been nine years since I played Minecraft. I'm probably just making it up, to be honest, but it sounds a lot like it from like a lot like what I remember it to be like. Yeah, it spawns at the freaking center. I tried to jump up the left side. I think using the left sides is gonna be really helpful. Cause right now I only really use the right hand sides because it, for the most part, keeps me able to shoot. That was dangerous. Yeah, that was dumb. I just, I jumped and missed. And I jumped at the point in time where I needed. To succeed. Oh shit. I like fell asleep at the wheel.
Yeah, it doesn't spawn off Hello Kitty. That's crazy, actually. I fell off the thing. Just took a break to beat Bashi. <laughs> yeah, okay, buddy. Send the fucking clip. I feel like I'm never going to be able to play another platformer after this game because all the movement's going to feel way worse because it's not Bashi. Why did it snipe above me? I'm still having nightmares of that Sonic fight. Good thing I'm never going to fucking make it there because I'm just going to be playing good old Hello Kitty for the next 55 years of my life. What am I doing? What am I doing? Get out of here, bro. I hate when the first one's like inexplicably really fast. Okay. We're working on using the left sides. I think it's not possible to win this without using the left sides. See, I fell down. I probably needed to jump up. I'm not viewing jumping up as a valid option. When uh, all of that's going. So there's two options. I can learn to, I can try to learn to jump up while that's happening. Or I can start at the top. It's a little hard to start at the top because they're raining Hello Kitties. Oh, you fucker. Oh, you fucker. Fuck. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. Bold assumption that the stress and failure anxiety of the game will let you live another 55 years stuck on Hello Kitty. So here's the thing. I think that I would normally live to be 112. So uh, I think that's why uh, 55 is a conservative estimate, you know? Plus I'm only seven right now. So when I beat the game, it'll be that much more impressive because Christian beat it in high school. Fuck. I've got to 15 HP like a hundred times. As in, like, gotten this boss to 15 HP? Oh, shit. This is suboptimal. We don't like this at all. Okay.
No! No! Okay. That was a pretty good run. 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 Don't even worry about it. Okay, we're getting better. We're gaining skill. Let's just give a let's just give ourselves a little a little woo. woo -hoo -hoo. Okay, we're getting we're getting hype. We're keeping the fingers warm. We've hydrated. We're stretching. All right, let's fucking get it. Wait, is my music volume low? We're going to bump the volume a little bit. Wait. Is the volume off? Hell Do you guys hear sound? Cuz I don't hear sound. My sound is gone. Bro, we did, but not anymore. Okay, so as long as you guys also don't. Hear it. Dude, all the sounds gone. What the fuck? I probably got to relaunch the game. Oh no, I want to be the Bashi not responding. That's not great. All right, chat. Let's try relaunching. Save file dot any. Interesting. Maybe I could just throw some fucking values around in there and get us a move on. It reset my freaking controls. Every time I close the game, it resets my controls. Why does L not do anything, by the way? My freaking controls! <laughs> no restart. I wanted to see pain. Don't worry, I already tested it yesterday. Sorry, I'm not skipping the boss thing right now because I'm adjusting my mic. That was dumb. My mic arm sometimes, after I like adjust it, will float in such a way that it sort of blocks a portion of my screen. Dude, why does that one, when it randomly shoots above me, is the time it really fucks me up. Okay, nice. The problem with Bashi is you can't stop paying attention for even like a frickin' second. Dumb. Okay, okay, okay. We just gotta get back in the rhythm. The having to restart actually took me so out of the rhythm. Yeah, that was bad gap finding. That was bad gap finding. But don't even worry about it, chat. Oh, fuck.
Dude, dumb. <laughs> no! I also feel like I'm figuring out new strats for the for the shooting. The problem is that right now I'm struggling to stay alive. Oh, why didn't I fucking fall off? Okay, okay, okay. I wish that I had like a... an understanding of where better players look. Right now, I think my eyes are just like unfocused for the most part. Dude, I fell onto the platform. Better players don't even look at the screen. <laughs> oh my god. But hey, at least it's Bashi time. Get out of here, bro. All right. We got to remember, using the left side is, like, integral. I fell. We got to work on our ability to use the left side. Like, really, I just need to recognize it as an option more often. I fell and gave myself no options, man. I fell. A better player just already has the macro on the keyboard to beat Bashi without playing the game and carrying on with his life. Honestly? But then I wouldn't be hanging out in chat with all of you wonderful folks, you know? I mean, like, really this is about life enrichment, okay? My life gets better the longer I play, which is why I'm really dragging out the run. Dude, like, what do I do? I just keep giving myself a bad start. Why do I keep giving myself a bad start? Guys, this is bad. I don't even know what time it is. 421, I think I saw. It's so easy to get so fucking addicted to this game. The time just melts away. It's bratty time, so true. Do we know if the hearts go in the same pattern every time? So, I think it zigzags, but it starts differently. So, like, it always does that weird shape. The, like, oh, wait, I gotta start over here. The, like, this.
Dumb. He snipes directly into the fucking gap! Are you kidding me, bro? Oh my god. Have I ever played Jump King before? I have not. I have not. I was gonna do Getting Over It, and then I was gonna do Jump King. But then Christian told me about this game and assured me that this game is way harder than those games. So, here we are. Yeah, I cannot believe that guy sniped the exact f correct gap. Because there's some randomization to these ones. It bounced a little bit too far. Oh shit, fucking, oh God. Get out of here, bro. Oh, well that's an easy one. I am so dumb. Oh, fuck. I have beat Bashi. I haven't beaten Jump King. You quit? There's no way. I mean, unless is Jump King just less fun? Because I, I feel like it, there's like a lot to be said for how personally fun you find a game's mechanics. Like, I enjoy playing this game so much more than I enjoyed playing Winnie the Pooh. So even though it might take you longer to beat a game like Bashi, you might have more fun and not end up quitting. Okay. Are you fucking kidding me? Ah! <laughs> no fucking way. Oh, I was so close. I was the fucking goat. I was so good. It's okay. It's okay, chat. It's okay. Look, we're improving. We're improving. We're getting in the reps. That's the part of this that no one understands. It's all about the reps. That's why I like to die in really simple, easy ways every once in a while. 
just to like get the reps in, you know, of like, hey, just so that when like you're actually trying to get the run in, you know not to do that, you know? So like that last one was like a throwaway. We weren't really trying to win that. We'll try to win this one, maybe. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see how it goes. I'm just getting the reps in. Oh, that's a bad one. That's a bad one. That's a bad one. Do you want a way to skip those spikes? I mean, would I love one? Absolutely. But unfortunately, no helping is allowed. So we're just dying on the spikes every time. Oh, I'm dumb. Let's see, is there like a, is there a way to get a save over here? Is that what it is? Hmm. There's an actual way to skip them? No way. Is it to beat Hello Kitty? <laughs> God damn it. Well, it's probably not going down that. That was my guess. That's all I've got. Yeah, take the portal. Dumb. I tried to land. Dumb. I bumped my head. I bumped my head. I actually took the portal on my first playthrough. Dude, why is the portal there? I did it too. The portal should not be there. The portal should be after you beat the freaking boss. Gave the game a try, got past the tutorial too hard. I commend you, Brad. Don't worry. You know, that's why we're just getting in the reps here so that the rest of the game will be easy. Dumb. Not a gap.
That was also a good run. That was also a good run. That was also a good run. <laughs> I believe I made a grave mistake saying only 53,000 deaths. I'm only at 3,000. Don't even worry about it. Don't even worry about it. It's not even bad. You showed Katie the final boss? That's not fair. What if she wants to play, bro? All right, Katie, give it to me straight. When am I beating this game? You know me better than anyone, so I, I think that you can give me the most accurate guesstimate. You greedy motherfucker. Why would I do this? Why would I do this? Katie beat it already. So true. All right, Katie. When? When am I beating the game? I need you to give me like a timeline. Okay? You know me. You know what I'm capable of. September 25th, 2055. Katie, come on. You were supposed to give me like a really great, encouraging answer. Like, oh yeah, it's not that bad, Brad. You can beat it. I failed to identify the initial gap. <sighs> Sometime between now and the heat death of the universe. You know, that speaks confidence though. That says that you think I will beat the game. Dude, I got stuck on the ledge. Dude, these spikes are so goddamn annoying. Thank God we're all here for the spikes content. You can't stay in one place for that long. They're gonna burn you for it. It's bashy time. God, I love the spikes. No, I whiffed. All right, let's get our damage up. I keep doing that. You know, it's a real sweet spot to get through here.
Oh, yeah. It's so fucking easy, bro. Oh, no. My fucking nose itches, bro. Thank God. It's bratty time. Let's go. All right. Sometimes you gotta try and pull crazy maneuvers, okay? Fuck. Huh! Not hitting the ground actually works pretty well. Oh shit. Dude, I fell! I fucking fell! Yo, Christian with the $100 donation. Very excited for this to go to charity in 500 hours when Brad gives up. You fucking wish, buddy. I'm taking your goddamn money. I mean, uh, you know, I love charity and everything, though. Don't get me wrong. But they're not seeing a dime. I mean, like, maybe I'll donate something, I don't know. But like, you know, I'm earning the money first, okay? This guy's a massive asshole. This guy's a massive asshole. I wish Brad was my dad. You wouldn't have gave up on me. You know it, man. You know it. Okay, I'm sticking it out. If there's one thing I'm doing, it's sticking it out. There we go. Guys, it's Bashi time. I fucking hate my life. This is probably the hardest known beatable platformer with a following, which is why we're going to play Tohu next. I don't know what that is. Is that without a following? Is that your point? That it's the hardest platformer game with no following? Christian's gonna have content for me for the next fucking five years of my life. I'm gonna turn 30 and be like, all right guys, finally beaten fucking getting over it.
No way. Tohu is 15 times. Tohu 15 is probably worse, which is what we're going to play. What is Tohu 15? It, are there 15 Tohus? For a second, I thought you said it was 15 times worse. There are 15 of these and what people don't know about them and they're crazy hard platformers. But the thing is people knew about Bashi, no? You fucker. It bounced left. So left. So far left. <sighs> what the fuck is point device mode? Your goal is to make me give up on something? There's no way. That's fucked up. Shouldn't your goal be to encourage your friend to become better at video games for the enjoyment of the masses? I think I should only be held to playing games that Christian has beaten in ways that Christian has beaten them. Okay, that's all I'm saying. Fucker! 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 I have no idea what this game is, but I feel like it's an elaborate ruse to torture Brad again, <laughs> going off on a limb. You know? A little bit. A little bit. I, I would not be surprised if that's the gimmick. However, I feel like it should have to at least be, like, something that he's beaten. Uh, that's all I'm saying. Some of my jumps are getting kind of clean, though, is all I'm saying. I fucking... I couldn't find the gap. Why couldn't I find the gap? Dude, those spikes can get so goddamn annoying.
God damn it. Arbitrary game restrictions are considered out of scope. Game itself has to be hard. That's true. That's true. I think it's way less fun if it's something like you have to beat this game with a Guitar Hero controller or whatever. Unless it was like a game I had already beaten and was really good at. I could see that. But like taking an OK kind of difficult game and being like beat it for the first time in this very annoying way, I feel like is not as good. Because it's the type of thing that I feel like Bashi is really good because people can come into chat, see me play, be like, how hard is this game? And then go in. I whipped that jump like four times. People can go and just download the game and experience what I'm experiencing easily and be like, oh yeah, that's hard. Or, oh, that game is not that hard. Brad just sucks. And get like a good sense of what I'm dealing with. The Guitar Hero controller styles shtick. You, you can't really like do that easily. Bashi with a Guitar Hero controller is simply uh, not gonna happen. I mean, the important thing, though, is like, as you progress, your own personal skill at platforming gets way better. So it's like, yes, looking at the final boss after you've seen me struggle on this right now, it's like, oh, yeah, he'd never beat that. But it's like, I don't know. I just feel like it's not a fair comparison in the sense that like, Obviously, I'm going to have to become significantly better to even reach that point. Clip it. Bro, look, I'm just saying it's not a fair comparison. Now, if the final boss is like out of nowhere, leagues and leagues harder, then yeah, sure. But if the game steadily progresses up to that point, I feel like it's a very different thing. That was so dumb. I wanted to start up at the top. God damn it, dude. Oh my God. Final boss isn't the hardest. If you reach it, you can beat it 100%. <laughs> yeah, this is the very first boss of the game. But getting here is non-trivial. Although I guess on the second attempt through, after I had built my skills, it only took me like 30 minutes. But that's the thing is like, it only took me 30 minutes to do what took me like four hours to do before that. I just feel like you get better.
Fucker. I hate this guy. Think like 8% completion? Okay, that's not actually terrible. As in, it will be 8% completion after I beat the boss or before I beat the boss, it's 8% completion. What are the projectiles supposed to be? Trust me, I wish I knew. Wait, what happened to the exclamation point prize command? Can, nor can people not run that? Oh, oh, I can fix that. I can fix that. I, I didn't know that that was even a setting. I don't even see that. How? Oh, wait. Dude, I don't see that at all. If a user... Ha yeah, it says leave blank for all roles. I, I don't see that at all. Can anyone run any commands that isn't a mod? I don't understand. Huh? How do I fix the prize command? We are all mods now. <laughs> Dude, I have no idea. But anyway, let's go back to some Bashi. What do you guys think? Why did I go up? Going up is the objectively worse decision. Guys? Yeah, I made it impossible to win because I fell all the way down. Dumb. Also, don't worry, guys. I'll make the exclamation point prize that's in the UI look better uh, before the next stream. I just didn't want to take time to do it now. I'll make it a part of the actual donation goal widget thing so it can match the font and everything like that. I couldn't find the gap. Ay, ay, ay. I should start predictions for like if I'll make it before a certain death counter. I don't even know how to run predictions, though. I'm going to be honest. And I don't have a thing that, like, displays it on my stream. So it might not be that entertaining. It's a bad run.
dumb. I ran one. What? What's the prediction? Before 4,000 deaths. That's a good one. That's a good one. Everyone bet your Brad Bucks. Get out of here. See that mouse come fucking creeping in, kill me right as I'm about to beat the boss. You fucker! <sighs> My fucking god, bro.